Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. I am Alex with Crafty Me Geek and today I have another Dollar Tree haul for you. I have lots of new items to share with you today, so let's get started. I'm going to start off with the new books that I picked up. I found three awesome new books. This one is by Chrissy Taylor, founder of the Taylor House No Prep Slow Cooker few ingredient meals without the browning, sauteing, or pre-baking. This originally retailed for $19.99 US. I'll give you a quick flip through here. So I was really happy to find that because I do love a good uh, crock pot meal. So convenient, especially on uh, busy weekends or work days when someone else is around to check on it every now and then. Next I picked up Express Lane Cooking, 8 Quick Shop Meals Using 5 Ingredients. This one is by Sean Syphus, founder of the blog I Wash, You Dry. This also originally retailed for $19.99 US. Gonna give you a quick flip through on this one as well. So I was super happy to find that one too. Because few ingredient meals are a lifesaver. Okay, and the last one I picked up is Easy as Pie Pops. Small in size and huge on flavor and fun. This is by Andrea Simatona, founder of Cakewalk Desserts. This again was originally sold for uh, $19.99 US. Cute, delicious, and fun mini desserts for every occasion. Whether you want something sweet, fruity, or savory, Easy as Pie Pops has the perfect bite-sized treats that will be a hit with family and friends. Pie Pop recipes include pumpkin cheesecake, strawberry limeade, Nutella s'more, Gouda broccoli quiche, caramel apple, black forest, coconut cream, pizza pocket, creme brulee, peppermint pudding, vegetable roll, and peachy keen. So I'm going to do another quick flip through for you. So those are the three books that I picked up this time. Here they are again. Okay. Now let's see what's next. I found the new Whimsical Fairy Garden set. So I found the red truck and the trailer. These are so cute. The paint jobs are a little messy, but I think that just kind of adds to the rustic cuteness of these. So I did just get one of each. Oh, I didn't realize that one was a little messed up, but that's okay. That was super cute. And then these have been at Dollar Tree for a little while now, but this is the first time that I'm seeing them at my stores, and currently only one of my stores has put them out. 
These are the dried flower bouquets. This one is the white bouquet. And these are just beautiful. I do have a bouquet of wooden roses that my boyfriend got me for my birthday last year, I think. So I figured that this might look nice. Some of this might look nice with those roses. So I got one of those. Next I found a new plastic tote. I was using it as an organizer, so let me just clean this out. Oh no, something leaked. Shoot. Okay. Mm. okay. This is messy. What leaked? Sorry guys, give me just a second. Hey guys, sorry about that. I think I got it figured out. I made the mistake of leaving one of those little uh, gel bead, little Orby uh, air fresheners in the car overnight. So I think they probably got cold and yeah, liquid just oozed out from the, from the seal. But anyway, I found the new Home Essentials plastic tote bag. This is the only size that they had of this and they did have it in three different colors. They had it in this gray, they had it in a navy, and they had it in turquoise. But I just got one in the gray. I thought this might be good for beach stuff because, you know, it is definitely waterproof. So, yeah, that's why I got it, because hopefully we will be going to the beach this year. Hopefully. Okay. Next, I have a few miscellaneous items for you. Oh, and this is just... Everything smells like Hawaiian breeze now. Okay, I picked up a um, bottle, canister, whatever this is, of Trident Vibes Peppermint Wave. This is 40 pieces of gum. Got this just to leave in the car. I might get a second one to leave up at work, so I have some gum at work. Keeps me from grinding my teeth. And then I picked up a pack of these stickers. I thought these were really cute. They did remind me of Valentine's Day. So I picked those up. Hopefully they didn't get damaged by my air freshener. Next I grabbed a new tote bag. This is a Disney villain tote bag featuring Maleficent. This is a really good quality tote bag as far as what the Dollar Tree typically carries. And I'm probably going to put my sister's birthday present in this bag in a few months because her favorite Disney villain is Maleficent. And then I found these feline fun bags. This is a bag infused with catnip. I thought that was super adorable. Now I'm just going to open this up real quick. One, to make sure it didn't get any water damage from my air freshener. And two, to show you this adorable design. Okay, so it comes with this. And this is 25% off and a $10 free cat gift if you use a promo code for their cat boxes. So this, has, this product or this product line has been featured on Ellen, Martha Stewart, and Animal Planet. 
that is pretty cool. I didn't realize that. But this is all it is. It is a little paper bag, but it has the cutest little designs on it. Little paws, little cats, little yin yang cats, cool cats. Heart paw prints, little fish bones. So, yeah, I saw this, and the only part of the design that I could see was this. But this is just so cute. And my cat loves to play in boxes and bags, and anytime I go to the grocery store, she just climbs all over the bags because she just loves playing with stuff like that. So especially since this has catnip, I think this is going to be great for cats. So I just got one of those to see how my cat likes it. I'll probably give, her, give it to her tonight. If she enjoys it, then I'll go grab a couple more. Maybe give some to my friends that have cats. I think that was the last random item. No, it's two more. It's two more. Got ahead myself. They put out some new children's socks. They had Minnie Mouse, Paw Patrol, uh, Jojo Siwa, LOL dolls, and a few other designs that will be in a Shop With Me video. But I do have a friend or my boyfriend has a friend that um, their daughter is turning one next month and we were invited to her birthday party so I picked up these two little pairs of socks to put into her birthday gift bag so I grabbed the Jojo Siwa socks and I grabbed the LOL socks and these are just so adorable. Okay. Now, the rest of this haul is going to be Cake Boss. Okay. I really need to try to get some more control of myself when it comes to the cake boss. I just can't help it. Okay, so I found some of these cake servers with the timeless wooden handle. I went ahead and picked up one of those because the wooden handle on the cake server is just beautiful and yeah, I love the wooden handle so much more than the rubber handles, but I do like the convenience that the rubber handles can be put in the dishwasher. But I did go ahead and get this. And then I found some of the wooden handled whisks. These are the balloon whisks. And these are the silicone covered ones. I was so happy to find these because we've been needing some more whisks and I prefer the silicone covered whisks because they don't damage some of the pans if you're, if you're making some scrambled eggs in the pan. It doesn't scratch up the pan and it's, it's just so much easier to clean and work with. And next I found one of the Cake Boss four-piece truck set fondant cookie cutter presses. These are super cute. Here's what you get. You get four little trucks. Let's see if this is easy to open. And I can show you the size of them. So 
so there's what they look like in the package. I'm just going to take out this little fire truck. So those are a pretty good size, and those are super cute. Next, I found the Icing Duo decorating bags. This box contains 25 18 inch Duo Icing Duo decorating bags. So these bags have two chambers, so it makes it easier to decorate with two colors at once. There's the product features. And it does say that these work with the Cake Boss uh, decorating set, but that's not included. So the icing tip and the, uh, oh, what is that called? The connector, the icing tip and the connector, they're not included with this. This is just a box of bags. Okay, and the last items that I got today are some utensils. Sorry about that. There is a guy standing right next to my car smoking. So the next items that I picked up were these four piece baking tool sets. And one of them was missing a piece, so I got a four set and a three set, but that's okay with me because I've gotten plenty of these silicone utensils before. But these sets include these four utensils. So it comes with the My Kitchen, My Rules, the Born to Bake, or the My Kitchen, My Rules Spoonula, the Born to Bake Spatula, the Devoted to Dessert Spoonula, and the Mix It Up Spatula. So for one dollar, in this box, because it is a four-piece tool set, you get all four of these for one dollar. Or you should, if your stores don't open up the packages and sell them individually. Which they're not supposed to do because they're not labeled for individual sale. This is marked as a set. So yeah, I got two of these. One is missing out of the other set, but that's okay with me. And that's all I have to share with you today. I hope you enjoyed. I want to thank you for stopping by and joining me today. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. If you enjoyed this video, please hit like and subscribe down below. It would really help out my channel. Um, leave a comment down below. Let me know what your favorite item from this video was. If there's anything that you're seeing at your local stores that I should be watching for, let me know. And... I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.